hey guys welcome to a new video okay so today we have pot stickers these are chicken pot stickers i am so excited um i'm hungry i have diet coke caffeine free and a water um all right so this is how i like to eat mine i like to add some sriracha and then i add some soy i have these propped up so you guys can see better we're gonna see how this works i love this okay are you gonna eat with these i know hey i'm gonna stick these in my nose <laughs> so funny Let's take our first bite. Sometimes I use a fork, but I said, you know what? We're about to just like go in for it today. Oh, she passed away? Oh. Mm. All right. Mm. This is delicious. If you guys hear typing, my girlfriend is actually in the room. She is working right now. So. <laughs> I am getting help for binge eating. Um. I'm doing an actual eating disorder program at an eating disorder clinic. So one of the very first things I was very open about was my YouTube channel because this is my income. This is my life. It has been for over eight years now. Um, so I wanted my psychologist to know what I do on YouTube. What do you do on Twitter? What do you kids do on Twitter? And I needed to know like what she thought of eating on camera. Like, is this gonna be bad for my recovery? Um, so I was completely honest with her about everything. I told her the ways that watching mukbangs is triggering for me. If I'm sitting at home watching a mukbang, it makes me want to binge. Nine times out of ten, I'm craving the food that I'm watching these people eat. So it's triggering for me. But filming mukbangs does the opposite effect. Um, I'm more cautious about what I'm eating. I eat slower. I'm more aware of my food and how it tastes because I have to talk to you guys about it. Um... I eat slower. Ah. It's helpful to me. And I've explained that filming mukbangs is helpful to me. I've explained this multiple times. 
Um, and if I was to be eating this meal, like without filming it, I'd be, I'd maybe have like two left. I'd be almost done. I wouldn't be like enjoying it as much because I would just be like stuffing my face. I don't know how to explain it, but long story short. Um, my psychologist supports me filming mukbangs. That That's not good. I feel the need to say the F word now. That are obviously me not binging. So, one thing, I have never filmed a mukbang that was binging. I never will. Ever. Um, no. Have I filmed like what I ate today videos of food that, um, I did binge on? Yes. But my boot box have always just been me eating a normal meal. And yeah, in recovery, anything that helps you not binge or helps you be more aware of like what you're eating and the quantities that you're eating and enjoying the food more is supported so mukbangs are supported mm. it's just so good I low-key wish I would have gotten a fork because <laughs> they're also so messy and I hate uh -uh. something about like lots of food on my fingers. I don't like it very much, but 